Hey, good morning, guys. This is uh, Coach Lou, and I just want to tell all of you happy hump day. I like to call it happy pump hump day. Um, it's kind of like a, you know, a great middle of the day, middle of the week workout day, if you will. Um, I would love if all of you could post what workout you're going to do today, but I wanted to tell you something really important. Uh, this is, this is super, super important. Today is the day after Valentine's Day. And you're probably wondering what that means. And I'm going to tell you what it means. It's a really sneaky thing that retailers will do that's totally in their benefit. And it's going to hurt you. It's going to feel good at first. And I think you know where I'm going. You're going to find that there is going to be a ton of <laughs> Valentine's Day candy. Half off. Half off. Half off. Half priced on sale at your CVS, at your local Walgreens, at your pharmacy, at Walmart, everywhere. It's going to be half off. And they want you to come in and buy as much of this candy as you can so that you can further enhance the size and girth of your beautiful muffin top that's stopping you from being the happiest person you can be on this planet. Now, I have an alternative. My alternative is don't go buy the Halloween... Not the Halloween, I'm sorry... Uh, don't go buy the Valentine's Day candy that's on sale. Screw that. You don't want to get that. You it, Look, why don't you just bypass that completely? And, you know, if you're having a chocolate fix, there are alternatives. Um, Charlotte's probably told you guys about Shakeology. I don't know if you know what that is. If you don't know, I will gladly tell you or send you a sample if you want one at my cost. The other thing is you could buy, um, you know, you could buy, like, bars of chocolate that are just like, you know, 90% or 80% cocoa, cacao, however it's pronounced, whatever. You can, you have alternatives. Um, you can also take fruit and dip it in um, protein powder that's been mixed with a little coconut oil, and when you put that in the fridge for a little bit, it's going to get a nice hard casing. There's, there's so many things you can do to avoid cheating on a diet, to avoid compromising your healthy lifestyle, because Let's face it, I've been there before, I know you guys have. If you eat some great pile of Valentine's Day candy, like you might have done on Halloween, you're going to feel like shit. And it's going to hurt you, it's going to make you feel terrible for a long time. It's not worth it. I'd rather you go to Godiva and suffer the pain of spending $30 for a box of 10 little tiny truffles knowing that you want each one to last an entire two months because of how much you paid. It's definitely worth it that way. But, again, guys, seriously, don't give in to this madness. Don't go and blow a lot of money or any money on some Valentine's Day sweets. Um, I'm really having fun with you guys. I'm getting to know some of you on a personal level. I'll send out a few more friend requests. I hope you guys are um, finding that I'm going to help you, that I'm the real deal. I'm a very personable person. Uh, you know, great guy. I have a New York accent, if you haven't noticed by now. I'm sorry, that's how I was born. But I did live in Atlanta for a while, and it softened it a little bit. But in all seriousness, I hope you guys have a great day. Um, I'm going now to my day job. I'm, I'm an architect as well as a Beachbody coach. And tonight, I have a diehard goal to do my next workout, which is going to be body beats, bulk shoulders. I love that workout because it's really intense and I'm looking forward to it. So peace out, guys. I'll talk to you later.